she said something and she said, I know you're strong. It was just like, the situation that you're in is only temporary. It was just like, you just gotta stay strong. And I cried in a dream. And I hugged her and I was just like, girl, you're right. I am strong. She don't even know who I am. God darn it. And she telling me, in my dream, you're strong. God's got you. What you worried about? I guess it's just the confidence. Being a 24-year-old works at Burger King. Basically living paycheck to paycheck. I want to do more in life. I can't do more in life if I'm just in my bed sulking and listening to emo music and just beating myself. I can't do that. I got to invest in myself. Whatever direction I decide to go, reading vlogs, I just got to get confident. More with myself stop making excuses and just post but oh have a spa night why she hook oh also read I'm currently reading crave and then I'm reading, <laughs> I'm reading a book called The Nanny. <laughs> the Nanny and the Nerd is quite interesting, but it's on Kindle Unlimited. Child, please don't hit me. You're the most awkward girl you'll ever meet. I hope you chance with somebody. somebody. But you know what? I woke up this morning. That's all I can say. <coughs> I've been up for a while. I'm making something to eat. And this morning I decided I'm going to record myself and draw. Also, this drawing is no credit to me. I give all credit to this artist for giving me this reference to actually like get my point across of what I wanted to do for this Inuyasha painting, watercolor painting. I did some tweaks in there trying to make it my style. And she also wanted to add, I wanted to add a butterfly. She wanted to add a butterfly because the person that commissioned me, my best friend, she wanted four of her best boys, her best boys. And I said, I could do that. I could do that. I finished one. You know when I finished it? May. Need to get on it. I have more people commission me, so I'm just like, dang, get yourself together, lady. Get yourself together.
am done with the painting. Here he is. L let me turn it around. This is a big old sit.
and I'm in my car. <laughs> my way to work. My way to work. I just finished, well, yesterday, I just finished Lock the Doors. Hey, babe. As a kid, my mom used to tell me to stay with her. And she would, oh my gosh. <laughs> For the people that have grew, grew up with me, my mother would tell me as a kid, I can't sleep over at other friends' house. If she does not physically know them, their parents, and know them, she would not let me sleep over at their house. And people would be like, your mom is so protective. I'll be like, yeah, I know. Could you imagine 24 years later, I read a book and I'm just like, oh crap. It was intense. It took so long to get to the freaking plot. I said, okay, you're just over accessing everything. And I was just like, it was actually a good thing he did that because he would have never known the truth. Yeah, he would have never known the truth. Oh. Then I also finished Crave by Tracy Wolf. Again, it took me over a month to finish that book because I read it on my Kindle. And then it got to the plot. I was like, ooh! <laughs> you mean to tell me that Sugar Honey Ice Team was finna pick up in the middle of the book and I could not put it down? I was like, where was this? In the beginning? Even though it was slow, it turned to five stars. It, it was a five stars. I was at my friend's house reading that book. She was reading her Sorcery of Thorns because I told her she needed to read it. Sorcery of Thorns is another five star book for me. Oh my gosh. So she's reading that. She got halfway through her book and I finished my book. Baby. I mean, until she saw my reaction when I got to the plot twist. I said, I knew it! I knew it! <laughs> I knew it. She was like, girl, is it that good? I said, yes! <laughs> so basically, all I did this morning was write in my reading journal, which I do a digital reading journal. I don't like my handwriting. Good morning. I can't even say morning because I work at night. I don't get up until like 12 in the morning. I have to force myself to get up so I can get stuff done. Those two, because I need to work on another painting. She wants a Todoroki painting. Well, she wants, she has four, like I was explaining, she, she wants four boys, her best boys. And Zawa already finished. Inuyasha, which y'all just saw in this vlog, and the last two I need is Todoroki and the one she likes, Loki. I want to buy Poli, because last night it was cold. I slept with two blankets. I was very tempted to sleep with three. Oh, I was so comfortable, but it was so cold. I was ready to go home. I was like, why is it cold? And then I get out of the house now. It was kind of cool. My car says it's 64 degrees. I'm like, wait a minute. I ain't ready. Also, I'm going to include clips in this vlog as well. I went to Wasabi Con in Jacksonville, Florida. I am, well, from the con, from the location that we was at, the con was 40. 40 to 45 min minutes, give or take. But the day that me and my friend went, we didn't do two days, we just did the one, and she told me, well, Sundays is not really that busy. I said, okay, cool. Well, since it's my first con, I will do Sunday. And that's what we did. My other friends went the two days. Or the uh, my other friends will do the one day, but they went Saturday. So we didn't get a chance to see them Sunday. But it's already. But the voice actors of Naruto was there. Why well, I me mean, tell you she had a long line? She had a long line. I was like, well, okay, well, I can get a signed picture for my cousin because he loves Naruto. I mean, I'm not really into Naruto like that, but I'll do it. 
but I saw that how long that line is. The main person I wanted to see was a voice actress of Jolene Cujo from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Oh, she was so sweet. So sweet. I ran to her, I was like, Jolene! She said, yes! I was like, autograph! 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 <laughs> and then she was showing me the different prints and everything and I was like, okay, okay. And there was this one that I um, picked out. She was like, do you want me to put your name on it? And I said, yes. That's not even a question. Yes. <laughs> my money. Take my money. And I got a picture with her. It was amazing. Like, I guess she is my first kind of celebrity. And I even told her that. And she was like, oh, I'm not a celebrity. If my system dies this time, I'm putting it on the dock. <laughs> no! I put mine on the charger. What time is it? <laughs> it's 9.46 at night. I gotta redecorate anyway. For Halloween! I should have a new villager. Uh, Called Weber. I look what he look like. It's not fauna, but I want fauna. I, want fauna. I really want fauna. <laughs> Be there, be square. We literally binge watched them. <laughs> oh, he's from yours. Wait, what? He's from yours. He says, Hi, I'm Weaver from Tranquil. That's freaking funny. Literally, she has my, what was it? I have Flory. Flory, she has my Flory. And then now I have her, Weber. <laughs> That's so funny. She just kept asking me, I said, fine, go. I don't yeah. need you here. It'd be funny if I actually let her leave and then she went back to you. That would be so funny. I, I think Lionel did. said he wanted to go. I say <coughs> you was not. I got a hot chip. <coughs> what are you doing now? I'm gonna do my little patch that I have on top of my island, and I'm gonna make it into like a pumpkin patch. Mm, I'm gonna 
sama ini. I'm so complete my piece of candy at this point. If I had done that, I would have been pissed. Please donate to the I'm Broke Foundation. <laughs> I mean, I could. <laughs> this is gonna take me a while. <gasps> Red's on my island. Oh, baby. I'm me. Oh, baby. I might just have to open my gate so you can come over. Yeah. <laughs> 